it's open meetings law is there for everybody uh, to see and call the meeting. Arms? Yeah. Evans? Yes. Gunther? Yes. Lange? No. Hutt? Yeah. Matthew Hampson? Don't need a motion to legally Down at the bottom there, I will zoom in for you again so you can see it a little better. You can see down here at the bottom under the general fund, it's about 61 cents. And this is what I was talking about earlier. If normally that was higher next year, when, if someone might say, well, why, why was it 61 cents this year? And why is it back to what it normally was? Let's say, you know, 70 cents or whatever, whatever it is normally. We can, we can speak as to the why. Here's 139578. Just tried to mess with that and to get it down below 14 cents. The first couple times I ran it, the amounts and things like that were slightly above. As you know, earlier from the presentation, this has to be um, below 14 cents. The levy um, that uh, being presented to you is also lower than last year. Two good things that are coming up here. One, that our levy is lower than last year, and two, we're asking the same amount of money from our patrons as we did last year, versus the opposite of that, right? We're needing more, and we're having to raise it for. But raising the levy sometimes um, is okay. Uh, I, don't, I think the public, the general statement, probably wants to see it uh, slight increases or decreases rather than. You know, you've heard people talking about, oh, let's take a tax holiday and really give them a break this year. Well, next year, when you need it, you come back, then things change. So um, this, this uh, presentation here I'm showing you and the things I'm speaking about uh, just reflect what we need. Um, and then you can see the total. Oops, I'm sorry about that. Back to that. Five cents. I'm, I'm rounding again. It was a, just about 76 cents last year. It was like 759. So I could easily call that 76. Essentially, we're going from 76 to 75. If you want to speak in really round numbers, because we were just about 76 last year, and we're just barely above 75 this year. Okay. Here's uh, history. I just went uh, just dating back to 2013. I believe that 2013 is uh, reflective of when your bond was paid. That was before I came. Is that in fact the case, Dana? Do you remember? I can assume that. I believe. Either that or when land value was really starting to climb. Those sorts of things. Built school in '91. Yeah. 20-year loan. Or this, this, yeah. Or that might have been also a combination of that perhaps when the uh, land value was fine. But you can see it's gone down continuously. Yeah, Last year, almost 76 cents. This year, 75. And that's safe to say, even though it says 7599. 76 to 75 is a reasonable statement. Okay. Over 16, almost 16 and a half cents lower in the last five years. So that's, that's significant. We're still able to do all the things that we need to do. And we've 
been you know saving as well. We've been building up our cash reserves, as, as you may recall. We've been working on that as well. So, okay. Any questions about that short and sweet? How, how dramatic? Of, I mean, you can't project this. It's impossible. But what, what's our maximum level? What are we capable of? Percentage-wise, I'm asking for one a dollar. Is that dollar five? Dollar five. Dollar okay. nickel. Yeah. Yeah. So if we, I mean, if, if land values were to plummet, which I don't foresee that coming in the immediate future, do you think we would get back to that point? As you can see, it would have to be pretty bad to get that high, in my estimation. Have we ever been there? I, I don't know. So uh, yeah. Close to dollar. I think we were close to one percent. Well, you can see this is ninety-one. Yeah. 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 One percent. Yeah. 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 $76 cent levy, $760. You were asking me last year, I think, Claire, you're just like, okay, how much? But this year, if I did a 1% increase, I was telling you our land, when I say our land, the school district's land is just over 1% increase. So I just did a 1% increase. And so if I have a $101,000 home now, you know, this year because of that 1% increase. So at a, at a levy that's, um, you know, one cent lower, so I'm actually paying the last this year. You know, if you could, of course, multiply this. You could do the same math formula. If you have four million dollars worth of land, you know, you could increase that by one percent. You know, you could divide by a hundred and then times that by last year's levy here. That's what I did here. Oops. Or let me get back to that. 
so um, take a hundred thousand dollar home divided by a hundred gives me this this is last year's levy which means I, I pay this this year a one percent increase just in easy numbers you can see it's 101,000 divided by 100 again gives you this so I'm paying a little bit less at a little less levy this year of course if you have four million you know that's going to larger number than the three, than just the three dollars, two and a half dollars, but again, I think the things I've discussed with you this year, we're asking the same tax, asking as we did last year, the levy's going down, um, you know, our land valuation went up a little bit, these are all good things, and we've actually added staff this year, and you know, we added a full-time person. When I was asked by a patron about this, I just I referred to the fact that if you, you know, calculate this off to figure out our cost per people we, we're, we, we're getting a very good value for your now over here in our school district yeah. in comparison to the other school districts in the neighborhood our, our one cost per student to educate a student here is pretty low in comparison yeah. yeah we continue to ask for the things that we need um, that we feel that we need and that's what we do that's what's nice about being here as well we're doing what we think we need to do and support of the board and the community